Good morning, everyone. Uh, thank you for uh, taking a few times, a few, few, few minutes out of your day, I believe this morning for everybody that's on the call with us. Uh, my name is Brett Gartner. I'm the Director of Global Sales for ProSoft Technology. I'm based in Denver, Colorado. So the picture you see, if you see my video uh, behind me is the sunset, not sunrise. Uh, I wanted to uh, just take an opportunity today to really have a, a brief conversation about post-op and our measurement solutions integrated with the Rockwell control architecture. Uh, this is really one of my favorite activities in my job is an opportunity to, to meet with and, and discuss our solutions with customers. Uh, my only regret, of course, uh, during these times is I wish uh, I was there in person and had the opportunity to travel and, and see some of you again. Uh, very happy to see some, some familiar names in the, in the participant list. So thanks again for joining. Uh, the intention today is really to just be a, a brief introduction about the oil and gas measurement solutions, the uh, uh, hydrocarbon measurement uh, AFC module that ProSoft provides as part of a, a Rockwell integrated solution. So I'm just gonna run through uh, about five bullet points in, in today's agenda. I'll talk a little bit about uh, the trends that are affecting uh, everyone in the industry globally. Um, our focus for the applications for the AFC module and our, and our measurement solution give you a, a quick intro and, and some specifications and the details on uh, the, the ProSoft measurement solution, the AFC module. I'll discuss the, the benefits of, uh, of an integrated solution and share some system architectures that uh, we've had success with in, in several ins application installations. Again, uh, ideally, the, this is a, a conversation. If you have any questions as I'm uh, presenting this information, Feel free to interrupt me at any time. Uh, I welcome the, the dialogue. Or if there are any additional questions, um, you can also, as Lauren mentioned earlier, type them in the, the chat bar uh, through the Zoom interface. Um, also on the call for panelists tonight, uh, or this morning with us, is Eric Syme. Uh, Eric is our product manager for the AFC module, as well as other ProSoft solutions. Uh, he has uh, tremendous expertise and experience in this uh, system and this architecture, so he's available to answer any questions. Uh, along with Lauren and uh, Nikita Yang from our marketing uh, group, Lauren in Bakersfield, California, and Nikita in Shanghai, China, I believe. Oops. So for those of you uh, who may not know us, uh, just a quick overview of ProSoft. Um, we got our start as a industrial communications uh, company, uh, building interfaces to automation systems and, and automation devices, primarily uh, in the beginning through Modbus connectivity to the Rockwell architecture, as well as, as providing that interface to desperate system, systems and, and equipment in automation systems. Uh, Postoff was started in 1988, so we're, we're about 30 years old. Uh, and we continue to develop on that communications uh, solutions and expertise, um, expanding beyond Modbus into, I believe, up to 100 different protocol solutions today through both in chassis solutions and, and panel mount gateways and other devices that, that provide that application solution. Beyond that, uh, we have also focused to expand our capabilities by providing custom solutions around networking and application specific solutions. Uh, so the flow computer is, a, is an example of one of, one of our application specific solutions, along with uh, migration uh, devices that allow us to uh, modernize legacy systems uh, through different protocol conversions, as well as some other custom application development modules uh, for example, um, a, a module that provides an, an open platform Linux development environment to, 
develop uh, custom applications. We are also uh, wireless application solution experts. Uh, we have solutions in both RF and, and cellular technologies. Um, today, uh, we focus in uh, remote and system networking through 802.11 RF solutions, as well as deploying uh, cellular systems that support remote access and remote connectivity, as well as uh, the VPN networking. These are both uh, key technologies uh, also used with oil and gas applications. So I'm sure that uh, all of you are aware and of course affected by the global factors that are affecting the oil and gas industry today. Um, it started uh, at the beginning of the year with uh, some price competition and price wars between uh, OPEC and Russia that caused a, a dramatic decline in oil prices to, to kick off the year in, in, in January of 2020. Uh, of course, uh, for those of us who've worked in this industry and been involved with oil and gas uh, business for, for years, it, it's been common to see uh, declines in the industry and, 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 and pricing swings in, in, in the price of crude oil. Uh, this is the first time uh, I believe in history that we ever saw a situation where the crude oil prices actually uh, dropped below zero. So uh, as we know, essentially in, in some situations, customers were paying uh, companies to, to move oil for them or, or take the product. Of course, that was exasperated by the COVID situation uh, that greatly affected worldwide demand. Um, it's nice to see that we are feeling a, a bit of a rebound and a bit of an upward Tick again uh, from, the, from the bottom of uh, April and May, uh, and, and starting to see uh, a rebound in both and, and, and of course, affecting that, those prices. It is uh, unusual in, in my experience of 25 plus years in, in the automation industry and, and lots of focus in the oil and gas industry uh, to see the multiple factors uh, affecting the business and, and the pricing at once. To compound, uh, to compound uh, the situation, there are several manufacturers that are, that are using and still deploying solutions that are built on old architectures. Uh, and uh, a couple of those we know are, are migrating to new platforms, uh, obsoleting some, some older uh, solutions and systems that they had previously sold. So, uh, essentially forcing some of our customers to consider alternatives to some of the systems they may have already deployed. Um, as a result of the, the, the decrease in the drop in price, of course, producers and, and customers today uh, are, are looking for uh, reductions in CapEx and OpEx solutions and, uh, and, and ways to deploy new technologies to help with digitization um, to improve uh, the automation capabilities around control systems and measurement solutions that are deployed for for oil and gas applications. The applications where we focus uh, uh, the integrated solution with uh, a Rockwell PLC architecture combined with ProSoft measurement solution are those that combine um, on the production side that combine multiple wells or or lateral drilling operations on a single pad site, uh, whether that be onshore applications with, with fracking and, and horizontal drilling or offshore uh, applications where there's lateral drilling um, to, to connect uh, multiple reservoirs through a single platform. Um, these systems begin to resemble larger automation systems that require the, the power of the PLC uh, in many applications to, to meet the automation requirements. Uh, the I.O. counts uh, become exceedingly large, uh, where RTUs that are typically deployed on single well applications or, or smaller platforms uh, become challenged to uh, meet the, the I.O. and the process automation requirements from, from these larger systems. There are some other applications as well in the, in the pipelines, uh, namely uh, transfer 
stations or metering skids, uh, where this solution, again, has a, a great fit as a result of its uh, integrated design and integrated capability. So this is uh, typically the focus for ProSoft and, and Rockwell together uh, to create an integrated measurement solution that can combine both the, the power of the, the PLC functions and uh, the uh, measurement capabilities that are uh, provided through the ProSoft uh, AFC module. Typically in these applications, uh, many customers and many users would design a system uh, to combine both the functions of a dedicated RTU uh, or flow computer along with a, a PLC or PAC device in order to meet the, the automation requirements. Um, clearly in this design, uh, there is additional interwiring, uh, space, software, components, uh, technologies and, and capabilities that are, that are required to maintain and, and, and operate these systems. Uh, what we offer is the option to integrate the measurement solution directly into the PLC backplane with a, uh, a single card that supports the hydro hydrocarbon measurement application functions. Uh, it's very versatile. Uh, it'll support both liquid and gas applications and meets all of the requirements of uh, hydrocarbon measurement solutions. So th this product uh, is known as the AFC or automated flow computer. Uh, it is a, a single slot module that fits into both the Rockwell's uh, control logics architecture as well as the compact logics architecture. In the control logic platform, we can support up to 16 different meter runs. Um, any combination of gas or liquid measurement configurations. In the compact logics architecture, we support up to 12 meter runs per card. The system is highly scalable, scalable. Uh, as the application requirements expand and we need additional meter runs. Uh, Simply, we, we only need a, another slot to add in another module um, to expand the, the capabilities uh, to meet uh, additional meter interfaces. We've had applications up to 80 meter runs on large distributed well sites. This solution is, is provided uh, with all of the software that is required to set up and configure uh, and communicate the data from the measurement applications uh, with no fees and there are no licensing or um, measurement keys required to enable the gas and liquid applications. We follow all of the industry standard calculation methods, uh, AGA and API um, measurement standards uh, that are established globally. And all of the data is archived locally um, per each meter run set up and configured in the AFC module. The archive records can store up to 1,440 hourly records or 60 days, and 1,440 daily records, providing a, an excessive amount of local, non-volatile archiving capability that can then also be communicated directly from the module via an Ethernet connection uh, back to SCADA or shared with the process application via backplane exchange to the PLC controller. So some of the benefits uh, with the integrated solution, uh, first of all, by combining these two technologies together, technologies together in a single architecture, it's a significantly smaller footprint in your panel. So a great opportunity immediately to reduce panel size and enclosures and also eliminate uh, interwiring and networking between uh, different devices. A second benefit is that uh, each of the meter runs are independently configured for a liquid or gas application. So 
of the available 16 meter runs per AFC module in, comp in control logics, the user can configure any combination of liquid and gas measurement configurations to meet the site needs. And all of the archiving, alarming, and event logs associated with each meter configuration are stored as separate logs. As I mentioned, there's no licensing fees. All of the AFC measurement configuration software is provided at no cost through a simple download from our website. And there's no key or application keys required for the measurement applications. The system by design and being a, a function of the Rockwell architecture is, a, is, is easily scalable and can be, and can take advantage of some of the capabilities within the, the Rockwell control architecture, such as distributed I.O. to simplify and provide maximum flexibility in system design uh, to meet the, the application requirements. So one of the first applications where we see a tremendous value of the integrated solution is on a metering skid or in a custody transfer application uh, between a pipeline and a production site. In conjunction with Rockwell's compact logic solution in the fixed architecture, either L24 or L27, that provides us with the integrated high-speed counters for interfacing to pressure and temperature sensors to provide the data directly through that high-speed counter input, along with an interface through ProSoft Gateway to Modbus TCP or Modbus Serial to a Coriolis. Uh, the Compact Logic Solutions provides all of the functionality and capabilities required to meet the control requirements as well as the measurement uh, application requirements on a, on a metering skid. Very compact and a very low cost solution uh, that allows users to create a single design uh, with flexible capabilities for metering skid applications. The other focus for the integrated solution, again, is in the, the multi-well production applications where a distributed architecture provides great advantages in these scenarios. On these large applications, there's frequently multiple components and multiple pieces of equipment that require both measurement and control from a automation solution. The distributed architecture allows great flexibility through either distributed remote I.O. systems that can be located next to the remote equipment and interfaced back to a main controller via Ethernet, or using, for example, uh, Rockwell's point I.O. solution to interface both to meter applications through my TCP as well as I.O. Uh, connections to, to control uh, various pieces of equipment such as the separators, treaters, tank batteries, uh, or even the lack skid. This architecture really provides our customers with maximum flexibility in both design as well as uh, the maximum ability to reduce costs of the system by using the, the lowest cost components for the remote sites, uh, creating panels with common I.O. architectures that can fit all of the requirements for the different pieces of equipment, uh, to allow for maximum flexibility in, in system design and expansion. So those two applications are the, the primary applications where we've had great success with uh, the AFC and Rockwell's uh, control and compact logic solution. ProSoft also has multiple solutions and multiple products that kind of complete the the application requirements on many uh, gas and oil production sites. Um, of course, uh, a wide variety of communication interfaces to different devices using different protocols, such as HART or DMP3 or Profibus, to either gateways or uh, applications that are integrated into modules that plug directly into the, the PLC system. We also have local data logging capabilities 
that provide uh, the ability to connect to any of the data points within the PLC, log data into a, a low-cost panel mount device, and provide access through uh, direct connectivity to the gateway uh, to the data logger uh, to upload the, the, the data um, automatically or retrieve uh, logs in a situation where communication might have been lost. Through our wireless solutions, we can provide both industrial hotspots for RF connectivity to remote pieces of equipment on the well pad site, like the pump jacks uh, directed to the well heads or the tank batteries. That can bring the data then wirelessly back to the control system. And lastly, we, can, we have cellular capabilities to connect to these systems and provide a cellular connection, uh, essentially giving us internet access to the site, uh, either for SCADA connectivity, uh, back to a centralized uh, operation station, as well as in parallel connectivity for remote users who may want to uh, VPN in uh, to the controller and other intelligent devices on the site uh, for maintenance um, or uh, control functions that they can perform remotely. So that's kind of a, a, a high level introduction of the oil and gas solution for integrated measurement and control. Didn't want to take up any more than 30 minutes, so we have a few minutes left for uh, any questions. Um, hi, Brett. There is one that's come in um, from someone with limited CapEx available to uh, build a more connected oil and gas site. What do we typically see um, as an initial investment by people? So from an initial investment perspective, it's really just understanding what the total application requirements are from the control perspective and working with our partners in Rockwell to design and select uh, the control platform and control system that meets the application requirements. Uh, for the ProSoft measurement solution, uh, either the 1756 or MBI 56 uh, control logics module or 69 compact logic module provides all of the functionality required um, to meet those application requirements in terms of the measurement applications. Our website provides complete details on those solutions as well as videos uh, with, with training information and step-by-step -step configuration uh, information. And your local ProSoft uh, regional sales manager or distributor are, are great resources for additional details in terms of, of pricing and, and other configuration questions you may have. Awesome. Thanks, Lauren. Anything else out there from questions? Um, not yet. Anyone, if you guys have any questions, feel free to put them in that Q&A box down at the bottom of the screen. And, um... Um, I guess if there are no other questions, we can go ahead and um, and end this webinar. And um, just so everyone knows as well, by the end of this week, you'll be receiving the recording and slides um, from us. And oh, hold on. thank you very much. Uh, looks uh, like there is a question that just popped up. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Raymond, I believe uh, Go ahead and, uh, what does that mean that Eric is going to answer this question live? Let me unmute him real quick here. Great. Okay. Can you hear me? Yep. All right. Thank you. Uh, yes, for ISO standards, uh, we do support many of the ISO measurement standards, uh, such as uh, 6976, um, 
also as uh, ISO the 14.3 and various other ISO standards. Um, that is all listed on our, our data sheet. Uh, data sheet for the module has a very comprehensive list of all the measurement standards that we provide. Um, we do also provide the capability for proving. That was another question that came in from Edwin. Um, in liquid applications, we do have a built-in proving application within our EAFC manager software. And we do support any of the uh, uh, compact, or I'm sorry, the uh, unidirectional, bidirectional, and master meter proving options. Right now, we do not have a uh, support for a compact or a small volume prover, um, mainly because the high-speed counter interface doesn't support uh, the double chronometry pulse input on the Rockwell platform. So, um, but we do support all of the other proving options that we typically see in field applications. Great, thanks for the questions. Thanks, Eric. Okay, great. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. And um, yeah, like I said, we'll be sending you the recording by the end of this week. And um, in the meantime, have a great rest of your week and stay well. Stay well, everyone. Thanks again. Have a good day.